Hi, my name is Liz Sisk, and I'm an artist living in Washington, D.C. I graduated from East Lincoln in 2015 and then went to the University of Georgia where I studied scientific illustration. I currently work as a freelance scientific illustrator and I work with scientists, magazines, and research institutions to draw natural science like plants, animals, insects, and scientific diagrams. These are a few of my recent projects. I also do graphic design for nonprofits, including branding, social media, and web design. Being an artist full time is a lot of work, but it's definitely possible. I've always loved art and nature. When I was at East Lincoln, I took every art class I could, and I loved the journal projects, paintings, and Miss Falkenberry even let my friend and I paint a mural in the hallway, which is really fun. In my scientific illustration program at UGA, I took art classes like painting and drawing and scientific illustration techniques, and science classes like anatomy, physiology, and ecology. The summer before I graduated, I got an internship at the National Museum of Natural History in Washington, D.C., where I drew beetles for an entomologist, a person who studies insects, which was really fun. I moved to D.C. full-time after I graduated in 2019. Moving to a new city by myself was intimidating at first, but definitely worth it. D.C. has amazing art, museums, and science. This is my studio set up in my apartment. All of my work is digital, and I work from home. I use a tablet and stylus to draw in programs such as Photoshop, Illustrator, and InDesign. And this is my studio assistant. I also do painting commissions as well, but those are more for fun. A lot of people dismiss careers in art. However, there are definitely a lot of different opportunities like graphic design, book illustration, art education, video game design, painting, and specialized fields like scientific and medical illustration, just to name a few. However, it is a lot of work. If you're considering a career in art, I definitely recommend taking a few business classes because things like advertising, pricing, communicating with clients, and keeping track of your finances are really important for all artists to know. Some people also really love art but don't want to make a a whole career out of it and create art as a side job or as a hobby, which is also great. It's all about striking a balance that you personally enjoy. If you're interested in learning more about scientific illustration, being a full-time artist, or living in D.C., feel free to reach out. I have an Instagram, TikTok, and a website with my email address. Thanks, you guys.